What's happening YouTube? Chevelle 74 US here. Um, just wanted to take a quick look at these uh, new pry bar set that I got. I was at the uh, Sears today, which uh, now Sears aren't easy to come by. I had to travel about 45 minutes to my nearest Sears because um, the local one closed down like many of them are. Um, so we know that the uh, Craftsman brand was uh, sold off. But you could still, of course, get Craftsman in uh, Sears stores if you could find one nearby. Uh, wasn't particularly looking for anything, just walking by and I, I saw these pry bars. And what caught my eye was the USA Made. Now I was under the impression that, that all their stuff was made overseas. And uh, apparently not, so... These these were on sale for twenty four ninety nine, and uh, that's that's as of today, um, the day that this video is posted. And um, I think the regular price is like thirty nine dollars. But uh, I got home. I did a little bit of research on them, and the uh, the OEM manufacturer for these, from what I could tell. Um, looking on the garage journal board, I saw like a couple of threads about this is uh, wild and uh, you know It's got this P at the end of each pry bar and apparently P is is somehow the designation for the company wild that makes good good pry bars and uh, I know that they have different types of pry bars that, that they sell under the craftsman name that uh, other manufacturers like Mayhew make uh, but these, these from my research are made by Wild, and uh, at twenty-five bucks, I think that's that's a really good deal. Um, also, reading reviews online, everybody just says really good things about these, uh, especially like the uh, the striking cap at the end, and uh, they're pretty durable. The uh, the main bar, well, I'll go over the sizes first. This is uh, 12, 17, and 25 inches. I mean, they're, they're nominal dimensions. I think this is like 24 and a half, and this is like 17 and a little more. But uh, but this one, this one's 12 inches. The thickness of the bars are 3 eighths of an inch for the 12 and the 17. And the uh, the 25 inch is, ha is half inch. So they got a pretty nice, it looks like a black oxide finish. The, uh, according to the description on the, on the Sears website, these are made out of high carbon steel and then the, uh, the tips are, are tempered. Here's the tip on the uh, on the 12 inch. If you'll focus, the. Uh, the handles, the handles feel good. They're like a uh, like a hard plastic. I guess maybe you'd call it an acetate, but they're not they're not smooth like some of the other ones I've held. These kind of have a little bit of a uh, a texturing to them, so they're not as slippery. I guess if you get oil on them. And uh, it's on the back. They've got a warning here to wear safety goggles. But on the front, the Craftsman logo is just, it looks like it's some sort of screen printing or doesn't look to be a decal or anything like that. But uh, yeah, it's cool. They got the striking caps on them. This is going to be a nice addition to my, my big boy here. This is a, my 36 inch uh, Lawson which 
I've had this thing probably a good, I don't know, 18 years. And, uh, yeah, this thing hasn't bent, and I've, I've abused this plenty. This has a 5 8 inch uh, thickness in the shaft. Um, this kind of has a that hard plastic, but it's not textured. I can't find anything online about loss and pry bars. I mean, I didn't I didn't search for too long, but uh, I mean, who knows if they're even still manufacturing these, or if these were made by another company and just you know have the the loss and logo on it. But this was a this has been a great pry bar. You know, I would have liked to have gotten these two you know, all lost, and just because I know what I'm getting, but, um, I'm pleasantly surprised to know that these are made by a reputable, uh, manufacturer. So, yeah, I think it's a good value, um, and all I, all I hear is really good reviews on them. I've, oh, I've also seen a couple of, uh, you know, YouTube review videos where guys, you know, mechanics doing toolbox tours, and uh you know working in shops and you know loaded up with snap-on tools and 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 you know tool truck tools and and they seem to love these these new style pry bars now i believe that sears also makes or has made in the past a professional series pry bar set these aren't the professional series and perhaps this, these have even replaced them i'm not sure um I know the only difference between the professional series in the past versus the regular series was just the style of the handle. Everything else was the same. But, I mean, for all I know, and maybe somebody could chime in, it seems like they could have even been made by an entirely different manufacturer. Could have been an overseas manufacturer. You know, Sears has... I mean, they put their brand on a lot of tools that they have made for them so you don't you know you don't particularly know who makes what but yeah i'm pretty excited about these i mean for 25 bucks you can't go wrong so all right guys that's pretty much it um you know check out my other videos like and subscribe